All right, before we get out of here, I also have another conversation I want to play for you guys because I had a chance to catch up with Susan Larkin from Independence Blue Cross. Of course, the new jerseys were unveiled the other day. We got our first look at the road whites and the home darks. And the sponsor on them is Independence Blue Cross, IBX. So I had a chance to catch up with Susan Larkin from IBX to talk about the partnership with the Flyers, and here's that conversation. It is a special Friday edition of Flyers Daily, and joining us on this episode a couple days ago, the Flyers debuted the new era of orange jerseys. They are beautiful. From Independence Blue Cross, uh, we've got Susan Larkin. She's the Executive Vice President and the President of Core Markets, and she joins us on this episode to talk about this partnership with the Flyers. Susan, how are you? Great. How are you today? I'm very well. Oh, man. The, the New Jerseys, they came out. Let's get your first thoughts on the, the, the burnt orange and the New Jerseys and how they look. Oh, the jerseys look fabulous. It was so wonderful to see the jerseys last night with the burnt orange and the Independence Blue Cross blue logo. It was fabulous. When you see, you know, your company's logo on the jersey, this is the first, you know, logo on a Flyers jersey. When you see that, what's your reaction, you know, knowing that Independence Blue Cross has so much history steeped in Philadelphia, starting back in 1938 here in Philadelphia and has served the Delaware Valley and, and all over the nation. But as a, as a Philly company to be partnered and see that logo on the Flyers jersey, what was that reaction like for you? Well, at first, I, I really just want to start by saying that we are so excited to help usher in the new era as the official health insurance partner in the Philadelphia uh, for the Philadelphia Flyers and the exclusive home jersey sponsor. So first, so excited to even um, really be that official uh, partner. But seeing the jersey, it's so exciting to Philadelphia institutions coming together, similar to the Flyers. You know, we have a rich history in the region and have been part of the fabric of the community for a long time. And like the Flyers, you know, we serve the region with pride, with respect and loyalty. You know, that's the interesting thing to me, because, you know, you had the Ed Snyder Youth Hockey Foundation, which obviously is supported by uh, the Flyers organization. You have the Flyers, originally the Flyers Wives Fight for Lives Carnival so many years ago. And now this, the, the Flyers Carnival, which happens, uh, it's back, which is great and, you know, benefits so many great charities in the Philadelphia area. And Independence Blue Cross, so involved in the Philadelphia area. So why, why is it so important for these two, you know, mega names in Philadelphia and you know, corporations and, and entities to support each other with this partnership? Well, I mean, I would say we both organizations are just so committed to the to the community. And from I mean, as a health company, we are focused on the well-being of those in the communities we serve. And that's why the other reason this relationship was so fabulous, because this is an opportunity for us to include health and wellness um, to our members, to the fans. So, so this is this is about not just dealing with something um, when something goes wrong. This is about health and wellness to try and mitigate when things may go wrong. That's absolutely correct. I mean, as an organization, I mean, we are true. We love our we love our members, and we are committed um, to really focusing on that well being for those members. Yeah, so much of your health depends on how you live your life and to prevent problems from ever arising as well. Uh, you know, I, I did learn that the patch design mirrored what the Flyers did with the uniform. It honors tradition, but it also brings in a modern era. It's, it's really what the Flyers are all about right now is respecting the past, the tradition and the history, but paving a new path. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Well, I would say, well, first off, one of the exciting aspects of being the Jersey sponsor was the fact that they really were bringing the past and the future together. And quite frankly, that's what we did. We've got the Independence Blue Cross logo representing tradition, and we've got the IBX that really represents the future. It is our digital persona. It was part of our 2022 campaign. And it was really exciting to bring together along with the same, you know, the same approach that the Flyers took, really bringing both organizations together on that jersey. And I imagine that another part of that that you share with the Flyers is, you know, that that approach of collaboration, because with the, the very many departments of Independence Blue Cross, you've got to have that collaboration and you frankly, you got to have collaboration with your health as well. 
We absolutely do. And so again, very excited to be in the partnership for that collaboration. And when we think about that, Jersey, I really do want to acknowledge our team. Colleen Caffinal, who is our senior vice pre our senior um, marketing, chief marketing officer, excuse me, and our talented in-house graphic design team really worked very hard with the Flyers and the NHL to get that look, bringing in the past and the future on the jersey. And I will tell you that when we saw the jerseys last night, it was so exciting to have the players model the jersey and see how powerful it looked on the jersey. Um, last thing for you, uh, we got the preseason schedule here on uh, on Wednesday, and the Flyers' first home game of the preseason will be on September 30th. We're looking forward to the regular season. We'll get that date here coming up very shortly, probably be first week of October, around the 10th or so. Uh, but seeing you know seeing the players model the jerseys, cool. Seeing the players on the ice in equipment playing an NHL game in the jersey with your logo on it. Is that going to take it to a whole new level? I saw the jerseys. The jerseys are, I like them. I like the black number. I liked everything about them. And I go, yeah, they look great in the pictures and everything in the videos they put out. But I want to see them on the ice playing a game. I can't wait to see that. Oh, I can't wait to see. I cannot wait to see them on the ice. Um, we are really excited about it. And, you know, last night was just so fabulous. And, you know, I have to say, I, I wasn't a Flyers, I wasn't a hockey fan, right? I was not a hockey fan before last night, but I am so excited for September and watching the um, the, the Flyers. Well, you're Always a having... Philadelphia fan, but I just had never really been interested in hockey. And after last night and going through this process with the Flyers, they now have a number one fan. Well, you're now hooked. and, and I'm and, now hooked. I can't yeah. wait to uh, go to the games, not just to see that IBX uh, logo, but to really see the Flyers perform. You know what? I love that because this is how the sport gets hooks into people. It, it, you get there a different way, but then once you go to a game, you're done. It's over. Well, last <laughs> night, just sitting in the seat, in, in the stands with the fans and the questions and seeing the excitement and how excited they were for, um, you know, the changes that the team was making, I was inspired and I definitely are going to be there in September and can't wait to, uh, to attend as many games as possible. Well, it's going to be a great ride. You can visit IBX.com. Uh, that's where you can get more information on Independence Blue Cross. Susan, thanks for doing this so much. We really appreciate it. Uh, the partnership with the Flyers, the first Jersey patch partner of the Philadelphia Flyers Independence Blue Cross. Thanks for doing this. Thanks. Have a great day. Thanks to Susan Larkin for taking the time to join us on this episode of Flyers Daily. Can't wait to see those jerseys on the ice coming up in late September as the preseason will get underway. Everybody, thanks for listening. Have a great weekend. We're back Monday with Bill Meltzer on Draft Week. So we will join you then for a brand new episode of Flyers Daily.